This video is about an earthquake machine that Nikola Tesla built in his lab. This machine was capable of generating vibrations that could shake buildings. When Tesla started this machine, things got so out of hand that he had to use a sledgehammer and destroy it. And if he hadn't destroyed the machine, the building in which he was demonstrating it and several nearby buildings would have collapsed. Namaste. If you love science, do not forget to like and subscribe. Let's continue. In the late 19th century, Nikola Tesla was fascinated by the concept of resonance, a phenomena where objects naturally vibrate at a specific frequency. He believed that if one could match the natural frequency of an object, whether it is a metal beam, a building, or even the earth itself, one could introduce powerful vibrations in that object potentially causing it to shake or even collapse. To test his theory, Tesla built a mechanical oscillator, a machine capable of generating precise frequency of any object it is attached to. In 1898, Tesla sought to demonstrate the power of resonance by attaching this device to various objects. In front of a large group of people, Tesla attached this oscillator to a steel beam in his laboratory and began to increase the frequency. And as the machine hummed, the building started to shake. Slowly, as the vibrations intensified, it spread to neighboring buildings. Realizing the danger of his device, Tesla quickly grabbed a sledgehammer and smashed the machine to stop the vibration just before the situations got out of control. All of his neighbors were in shock. They thought that it was a big earthquake and later even police was called to investigate what really happened. When Tesla was asked about it, he said that if he had kept the machine running for just a few more minutes, he could have brought down the entire neighborhood. Even though Tesla's earthquake machine incident has been recounted many times, some people strongly believe that this story is largely exaggerated and the whole incident has been amplified over the years. However, resonance is very real. Engineers who design large buildings and bridges avoid resonant frequencies and the fact that you can break a glass with your voice is a big example of resonance. Tesla's mechanical oscillator was just the beginning. He actually wanted to harness the Earth's natural frequencies Tesla believed that by tapping into the Earth's resonant frequency, he would be able to transmit energy wirelessly across large distances. But after this disastrous failure, Tesla was shaken by the power of his own invention. He decided to destroy the machine and abandon any future experiments in this area. Do you think resonance can transfer energy over large distances as Tesla had once thought? Let me know in the comments below and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.